What's up, Bug Bruce? Today, we're talking about one of the most detested Minecraft mobs that actually do exist in real life, the silverfish. That's right, despite Mojang saying that they only make hostile mobs using fantasy creatures, the silverfish has broken the mold and forced its way into our reality and our hearts. So, what exactly is a silverfish? Silverfish are small, wingless insects that are often found in damp and humid environments, which is why you'll often encounter them chilling by toilets. Silverfish are also nocturnal creatures, so you're most likely to see them at night and have some nice company for your evening whiz. Just like butterflies and moths, they are also covered in fine scales, so handle these guys with care too much contact with their scales can brush them off, and you don't want to take a bug's clothes off. That's just rude. But what makes silverfish so special? Their survival skills. Silverfish have been around for over 400 million years. That's way before the dinosaurs. And they've been able to survive all these years because of their unique adaptations. They can go for a year without food as long as they have plenty of water and can live almost anywhere from Africa to Australia to here in North America. This means if you ask anybody that lives outside of your country if they got any silverfish hanging around their piss bowl, they'll probably say yes and to please stop calling the toilet that. Ever the hopeless romantic, silverfish also have an elaborate mating dance that can last up to half an hour, which is very long in bug years. They're also quite smart. Scientists placed silverfish in a complex maze to test their memory and navigation skills. Not only were they able to escape the maze, they also memorized the route within 14 days. Many of you have heard about a silverfish being passed, but let me tell you why they're not an issue. For one thing, they are incapable of hurting us physically, but may deal some emotional damage if you are frightened by them. Also, due to their powerful guts, they are capable of eating paper and photos. However, silverfish thrive and multiply in areas that reach 75 to 95 percent relative humidity. This is the humidity level at which mold grows, so you shouldn't be storing your precious belongings somewhere that gets that humid. If you have large populations of silverfish hanging around your place, you likely have bigger problems at hand. Seeing the occasional silverfish is just your homeboy chilling, he ain't got no plans to cause mischief. So next time you see a silverfish, don't be afraid. Just say hello to your new bathroom friend, the sparkly wonder of the insect world and the ruiner of Minecraft hardcore playthroughs.